Dude, Manny's group last week with the trucks. Yeah. I'll tell you what. All wheel we'll, drive. All wheel drive pickup truck could go that damn fast. Yeah. It was pretty intense. I, I really thought we were going to go to blow zero. You never know. Yeah. Tensions were high. Money was on the line. It was fast. Race night with Manny's group from Texas. Unbelievable. Let's not try to go any faster. Let's make him beat us. I'm a guy trying to fill up our team win right here. Thank God we got Chuck. He's our ace in the hole because on that last race, he won all the money and he beat an all-wheel drive truck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 405 to the front. <laughs> nice job, baby. Everybody always says Ryan carries us on his back. Well, Chuck carried us on his back. But we need to get this thing ready. Rusty Beaver and his crew, it's the 918. They're from Tulsa. And we go okay. way back. You know what? The 918 rivalry goes back 20 years or more. And I've been around for some of them. It gets intense. Tulsa is coming tomorrow. Be ready. So, I mean, what are y'all going to proclaim yourself as if we come down there and do paddle y'all's asses? None of you <laughs> have raced me. Hey, I ain't no You heard me. Crawl back in there, crawl dad. Won't you line up next to me then on the track? Put 275s on that <laughs> Put some white paint all over that <laughs> Bring it up there yeah, and run. Just so I can bust your <laughs> hot dog looking ass. There's usually a lot of shouting. There's some fists flying. And the racing is usually pretty good. I heard they're just bringing nothing but badass street cars, not race cars with the cut out of it to make it look like our street car version. Yeah. But these cars are real street cars that they race. I heard right now they got 15 mile an hour on just us. Wow. I think we're going to have our work cut out for us. Well, I'd like to go get some thinner fluid because that 30 weight we put in, JC said that that's just way too too thick. So he said that will okay. loosen it up 200. It makes All right, it well, let's, uh, let's go get some tranny fluid and we'll get this thing ripping. OK. Figured out yet? Well. Yes, and I wish I could say it was not self-inflicted, but it was. In my ever quest of going faster, I uh, just overlooked some basics, and I was just so confident and so pumped about just changing the pulley and just, you know, getting some more boost and can't wait to get out there that I didn't go test and got my ass kicked. Last race night sucked. Let me rephrase that. It sucked for me. It was good for us. We had a great night against Manny and the HPP team. I broke another blower belt at the one-two shift and lost to a car I shouldn't have lost to. Very, very heartbreaking for me. One, because I hate to lose. Two, because I would have been, should have been, the win that give us the eight overall total and the money. I made the mistake that I assumed, and it just made ass out of me. I'm pretty embarrassed that that's what the problem was. Pretty embarrassed that I didn't go test, so I wouldn't beat to... I wouldn't beat yourself up too bad. I well, mean, we're still learning the Pro Charger. We ain't got but a dozen passes at the most when it's your this. When it's your fault, you do beat yourself I, up. So I, it's, I do it's, understand that. And it still can use more boost. So if you'll look, the idler pulley is one groove off from the actual blower pulley. And they're so close together that <laughs> fighting each other. So now I'm going to take the blower off. I'm going to take that pulley off. And I'm not going to throw it away, but I'm probably never going to put it back on because me and that pulley don't get along. I'm take it back off. I'm going to put the little bitty pulley on it, which is the max that I can turn the blower. Then if it's still not enough, then I just don't have enough. Right. Blower cars do not run without anything blowing. And when that belt broke, there's nothing blowing. That particular problem will never happen again. Who we got coming in this week? For the longest time, all I ever heard was Rusty Beavers coming, Rusty Beavers coming. I thought people were playing a joke. It's not. It's actually the group from Tulsa, the blue collar guys. They're, they're bringing a couple of cars. I know nothing about Rusty Beaver or Rusty Beaver's team other than they're bringing some mouthy people that have said a lot of bad things about us, the 405 group, on the internet. I just know that his group are hopefully going to eat a lot of crow. 
Uh, hopefully the rusty beaver gets caged and we get out of this with another win. I don't know what kind of cars they're bringing. To me, it doesn't matter. Import, American, Mustang or not, it doesn't matter. I got to race who I'm matched up with and, and do the best I can and get a win for, for the team. That'll show us that we're, you know, that we're improving. We're getting better. And cash days is around the corner. Yeah. That's all that's that the way matters. it works. That's about all we can ask for. Get better each week and hope it all comes together for your cash days. Asian's birthday today too, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Happy oh, birthday, yeah. Asian. Right, well, let's get oh, it out of the birthday. way. Let's just get it out of the way so I don't hear it again. How old are you? 16? Yeah, 16? 16? 17? 17. 17. He looks like he's 12. I need you to buy me cigarettes. <laughs> so this is race night number eight. And honestly, man, through through seven races, man, we've done pretty damn well. Not mm -hmm. bad. Not bad. So, if we can pull tonight's win off, we'll be seven and one. These cars have come so far, Every so fast. These... And, and a lot of it has been our, our ability to get the right matchups in the driver's meeting. I think that the right matchups has has helped us yeah, whole... way more than what we realized. That's the whole game. Yes. I also believe that we've never been a tighter group than what we are right now. 100%. 100%. So, and that, that can't hurt us anywhere. So coming into this season, nobody really knew what we were gonna do. We've been on small tires before, but it's been a long time. I couldn't be more proud of this team and how we've came together. Not only did we prove to ourselves, but we've proved to everybody that small tire is something that 405 can do. We have to win this last race for the confidence of going into Street Wars. And now we're taking on rivals from way back when from the 918, Tulsa's group, led by Rusty Beaver. One last thing, I don't, I know, I don't have to explain to all of you guys, it was more intense against the 918 guys than it ever was with the Texas people. Before we started traveling out of state, there was never a bigger rivalry than what the 918 was with us. Rusty Beaver's kind of been around for a long time. We've raced with him before, but he put together his own crew, and a lot of these guys from the 918, we haven't raced with before, so coming into this, we're not 100% sure what we're going up against, but if they're anything like Rusty Beaver, then we're gonna have our hands full. Unlike some of the other weeks, we don't know a lot of these cars. We don't know a lot of these guys, so being strategic on the matchups that we do can make or break us here. When we get up there, we're 100% serious, 100%. I'm Rusty Beaver. The team is guys that I've raced with over the years, coming to put a spanking on whoever I race. Snow weights for fun thing is out the window. We're serious. When we, we leave this thing right here, make it to the race night, and you put your bottles in, you are serious. Heart attack. Just like we do on the street. We got some super fast cars they're going to find out. So I think our team, I'm not going to be cocky and say that we can win them all, but I think we're going to win the majority of them. This, this group of guys right here, in my opinion, you are uh, outstanding crew so all we got to do is do our job and perform and we got this man we got <laughs> i got this good little feeling in my bones oh, really? reaper totally fine with you uh, getting this deal started who we racing rusty beavers actually rusty and i grew up together so i asked rusty i said hey i said you want to gather some guys up and come do this deal and he said i'm in so this is the group of guys he brought we appreciate you guys bringing these cars uh, once we get out to the race spot, you guys more than welcome to walk around, look at all of our cars, because we're going to definitely look at y'all. So, truthfully, this thing doesn't have a lot out the back, but it will 60 foot. I made the full pass with the, the bottle on this time. Didn't pop and bang, so I'll take that as a plus. It felt good. 
me, Farm Trucker Asian, we want to be the first three down because they just work early, right? And we're putting rubber down for those that need more than what is first round. So we got the win against Tucker. Hopefully that sets the motivation for the entire team to kick butt in this lane all night long. You made a statement. Oof. You know? Ugh. Oh yeah. Man. Uh, you didn't need nothing. I like being first, but I hate being first. All at the same least. time, you know oh, what I mean? Okay. Bro, everybody has hey, so much confidence in you. You leave the confidence to us. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you know what you're told. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And, and, and we know where you belong. <laughs> no one's going to screw anybody out here. Hey, did you squeeze on him, or could you see him back there? Uh, no, I, I just made a hit with... I, I sprayed it the whole way through. Just, <laughs> yeah. I need to know. <laughs> I need to know. It works. I do All the right. same, dude. Thanks, fellas.